you're telling me 251 plus dead bodies were discovered behind a fucking prison in Jackson, Mississippi, and everyone's talking about Miami aliens? Much as we have been standing for every other country, which isn't wrong, we need to focus on just one state here in America right now. And if it wasn't sinister enough that these dead bodies were found behind a prison in Jackson, Mississippi, which is a sundown town, by the way, um, these dead bodies are not prisoners. Not only are these dead bodies not of Jackson State Facility prisoners, the prisoners in this Jackson, Mississippi prison were the people who buried them. So not only are these people in jail, but they were made to dig mass graves for dead bodies for people they did not know as part of their fucking sentence. Amongst these bodies, the amount of Caucasian bodies to what they have already found to be people of color, black people, is off, okay? And the, the thing that I need people to understand is this is a huge racial thing. I don't care what nobody says. And this isn't a conspiracy. Apparently, it's going on and on and on and unraveling to the point where there is have said to be a cop that actually killed someone and took him to that, that body, to that prison, and made prisoners bury that body in a mass grave. And this has just been going on. Mind you, I grew up in Jackson, Mississippi. I have grandparents that own land in Jackson and Bolton, Mississippi. And I literally went on field trips with my grandparents to cotton gins and we could never stay out past sundown. Jackson, Mississippi is a sundown town whether people think they still exist or not. One thing I'm gonna use my platform to call attention to is that them fucking good old boys knew exactly what they were doing by making other prisoners bury fucking people in a mass grave behind the prison because if I make you bury someone you think you're gonna tell or you're gonna be back there too. I want you to look at these hundreds of metal poles, these hundreds of bodies and people have come forth saying they have been looking for their family members. Their family, family members have been missing and not only that, the morgue has come forth and said that they don't got shit to do with this. When you want some truth, go to fucking Reddit. So I'm on Reddit, and I'm going to tell you what really, the one of the main things that caught my attention. It said the reason that this is a news story is because Jackson authorities are not doing any kind of attempt to contact some of the families of missing persons that are found dead or murdered and just bury them in the graveyard behind the prison, which naturally means the police appear to also not be doing any work to investigate these deaths. Not all 215 bodies fit the class classification, but there are several cases, uh, cases mentioned in various articles on the topic whose families thought the persons were still missing that came forward. And if you don't understand what happens with the good old boys and how tied in they are, you don't understand politics. If I, as a non-person of color in Jackson, Mississippi, catch someone who is a person of color out past sundown and I murder them and the police are the first to get there and instead of doing due justice to that person of color because I'm also a non-person of color, guess what we're going to do? We're going to rally against to protect a fellow brother in arms or whoever the fuck, a fellow white citizen. I'm just going to say white. I was trying not to say it. And we're going to go and we're going to bury that person behind that jail. Yeah. And no one's going to see it because you know what Jackson, Mississippi is? It's very rural. It's rural and there is literally trees. And I'm telling you, the local Walmart from my grandmother's house is at least a 45 minute drive. And this shit is, I, I don't see any other content creators really talking about it, how it is going down or, or seeing the bigger picture. But with, we have so much political shit going on right now. And you're telling me that there is not a fucking homicide investigation team out there investigating everybody? Because they're people of color in that grave. And I stand on that and I think it's bullshit. Sorry you guys had to hear me rant because I am going to do a more informational video. But I feel like as much as we are so focused on Stanley Cups 
aliens, politics, and everything else that does not affect everyone in this moment of time in America right here with our two feet on this soil, we need to be worried about people being murdered and families finding missing bodies of loved ones behind a massive grave. And the only reason it was found was because it smelled so bad because these bodies have not been embalmed. They have not had any after death, nothing done to them. They have just been thrown in a fucking grave and left there. I can't.